And she says everyone in Korea is wearing this brand called Fake Supreme. This could also be a, a bikini, he said. After the pandemic, I go, wait, Corona's over? Okay. <laughs> what brand is this? this is um Supreme. <laughs> I have something to show you. It's really important that you listen to the instructions as best as possible. So I'm gonna turn this on, okay? And this is gonna tell me the future of everything. Like it's like one of those eight balls. Fortune teller? Mm hmm. Okay. But it's clap activated. Okay, so ready? Ask it a question and then clap. Um, when will I be free? I think you should clap harder. Um, try again? Okay, just one more time. Okay, one more time. Am I supposed to clap here? <laughs> This is a prank sticker. So apparently you can stick this clap activated thing on anything and people will go up to it and just start clapping. But nothing's clap activated. I don't get it, what's going on? So what is this? I don't even know, I got a prank box. So you bought this, so uh, I'm just gonna sit here and clap all day? Yeah, I mean, your hands are red. He's like, you thought that I would fall for this? And his hands are like bright tomato red. <laughs> you don't think that's kind of funny? Wait, Look, what's going on? It's a prank box. It... I don't know what that one does, but these two stickers, this one you put and it says pull, but you should put it when it's a push. So you tape it onto the door. And then this one you tape onto something and it says clap Honey? activated. Why do you waste money like this? It was a surprise prank. I don't know what was going to be in there. Oh. Oh. So I got really excited and I needed five more dollars oh. to um, get free delivery oh. from Instacart, which is five dollars mm. so in retrospect <laughs> it would have been the same deal good morning my loves welcome back to today's vlog so today's vlog is going to be more of an experiment i honestly don't know what's happening i wanted to do this because i saw so many people like on the hollywood fix like these tiktok stars getting stopped by these hollywood fix people on this youtube channel that's like a youtube paparazzi they're like interviewing all of these tiktokers and each tiktoker has like on a different mask and i've been just wearing like those blue surgical masks and I'm like dang they look so much cooler than I do and I'm like they look like they've got I was gonna say they look like they've got the pandemic down but I know that the tiktokers don't because they've had like 25 parties but you get it like they look like they know how to do a stylish pandemic so I'm like what about me and so I ordered a couple masks now my mom refuses to let me wear them out until I do some sort of candle test that like she saw a bunch of Koreans who saw a bunch of Americans do it and it just seems like I don't know it What's seems that? lost in translation. So apparently, if you have a candle in front of you uh -huh. and you put on the mask and you can blow through it and take out the fire of the candle, uh -huh. then it is not good enough. But what if you're just like really good at blowing? I am. So the homemade masks, like yes. the fabric masks, they usually blow it out. Uh -huh. The surgical ones, it wavers a little bit. The N95s, even if it's right here, the light doesn't even move. Uh -huh. Like at so all. So I'm looking for at least not blowing it out. I got a couple things and I also got some things from Korean websites because I was like, you know what? They do have lower rates of coronavirus. So maybe they know something better about masks. Um, number one, they keep it on. That's probably why. But number two, what if they've got some dank ass masks? So I ordered this. What is this? Hello everyone, welcome back. That's good, I can't hear you well, so that's pretty good. It's crazy because I hear my voice. It sounds like I'm at a karaoke bar. <laughs> really loud in there. So this one, I would obviously wear a mask with it. I wouldn't just wear this by itself. Tell me the purpose of this. I don't know. I saw a lot of ajumas at H Mart wear shit like this and I was like, you know what? And it was $9 <laughs> on a Korean website. So I was like, fucking brilliant. I don't think I need to do a candle test for that one because I'm gonna wear it on top of all these masks anyway. And then I got something else from the Korean website that I really wanted to do the candle oh test on. Oh my <laughs> god, you were just doing the most. Oh, I gotta take this off. There's, ready? <laughs> what the? <sighs> Closer. Blow harder. Huh. Damn. That's good. Damn. And it shields your eyes, so if you are embarrassed to wear this. I thought you were going to wear it like this. <laughs> <laughs> he said, I thought you were going to wear it like this. <laughs> 
Do you like this? I can order one for you too. They have black, so you can look cool, like those Chinese TikTok streetwear. Yeah. Okay, so this one is approved. So then the next ones that I got, I wanted to get like these trendy ones because I realized that everyone's buying all these trendy ones like from Skims and all these other places. I couldn't get the ones from Kim Kardashian's Skim brand because they were constantly sold out and I was like, okay, that's fine. And I found a comparison that everyone's been loving. It's by a company by the name of, I have it written down, J. Sim Kai and a pack of Wait, so these. you're not gonna tell them where you got that Korean from? Oh, Yes Style, Yes Style. I thought, oh, these are all from Yes Style. Same with no. my earrings, same with my headbands. Oh, I got this headband that he keeps making fun of. Where do you get your fashion inspo from? See, that's the thing. I don't really get it from anywhere. I oh. like to look at something, and if it makes me go, <laughs> then I buy it. <laughs> So these are from a brand called J Simkai, and these are probably like one of the trendiest neutral masks so that I could find online. Everyone was like, you need to get this. Well, they come in a set of four. Okay, let me try one. They are kind of expensive. They're like $11 a piece, but you can only get them in a set, I think. So me? what's so special about this? It's just sleek, they said. Oh my God, your face is big, eh? It won't fit your face, eh? Oh man, these ears just keep popping out. Oh. Your face is big, eh? Your cheek is a little full, eh? <laughs> okay, they're really soft. I feel like I'm weak. That's kind of good, no? I'm dying from suffocation. Yeah, this one is- It's really <laughs> not breathable. Did you just cough straight into the yeah, mask? Like, oh, this... I wore it backwards, that's why. Because this kind of suffocates my nose. No, you wore it upside down. You wore it upside down. This goes up. No. Yes. No. Yes. Oh, no, I still can't breathe. <laughs> I don't like these. You really can't breathe. I, from my honest opinion, you cannot breathe in this. <laughs> okay, you can't Can you breathe? <sighs> <laughs> I'm lightheaded. I don't know how well this is going to protect you, but it feels really protective because you cannot breathe. No. You don't even feel like there's enough air. I breathe. <laughs> they pass the candle test, but do they pass all the other tests? Mm. Not really. It's okay. So then I got these from Bobble Bar. These were two for $20, so these were $10 each. I think maybe like $2 of tax. And these are great because you pay the cost. So they don't profit off of these masks, so you're not like overpaying for- Seriously? So yeah, you pay for the cost of it. I think they're hand done or something. How I much are they? Two for 20. So it's the same price? Mm-hmm. <laughs> This one smells a little interesting. Let me smell it. No, it smells like cotton. <laughs> I think you need to adjust the strap, honey. You just look really funny right now. They passed the candle test. That one was weird. I don't know how to feel about that one. Why don't you like it? I just don't like it. Okay, so these I saw were super popular. These are the affordable ones from Revolve. They come in three different colors. So they gave me a pink one and a black one and this blue one. Let me try on the what black one. What is that it's like a very breathable material, they said, which I don't know if it's gonna be good or bad for the pandemic. Whoa, you look like those Chinese uh, street. What? Oh, these Whoa. are comfortable. These are so comfortable. Mm -hmm. Well, they're so comfortable. They look yeah. kind of good, too. Mm -hmm. Try blow hardest. Hardest. Mm -hmm. Hardest. I need my inhaler to do better than that. Oh my god. I did it. You did it. So, should we not wear these? It looks cool. Yeah. But it's not the most heavy duty. My mom's not gonna allow that. This is, uh, I've got two more. These are my favorites. These are the most expensive masks that I've ever bought in my entire life. And honestly, what the fork is 2020 that I would spend this amount of money on a freaking mask? <laughs> so this one is by a designer by the name of Eugenia Kim, and she's Korean. And so I was like, well, then I have to buy it. <laughs> it was like 20, 30 dollars. This one was 30 dollars. This one is my favorite one. I I've already worn it out once. So you put it on like this. This looks pretty. It's like made out of silk, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's cool. Mm-hmm. <laughs> ah. <laughs> this one, I know when you guys look at it because I posted an Instagram picture wearing this strawberry shirt. And I was so embarrassed because everyone in the comments was like, oh my god, you got this strawberry dress? And I was like, just the shirt. Because it was half the fabric and half the price. 
but I got a face mask to go with it. So now when I wear the strawberry shirt, I can wear my strawberry mask to go out. This makes me so happy, okay? That's when my style started changing. Everyone who has been watching me since the beginning of my channel knows that when I used to work retail, I used to wear very like old looking things because I needed to look old. Otherwise, like who, what dude is gonna be like, yeah, let me just take engagement advice from this little bitch who don't know shit, right? And now I wear what makes me happy. Oh. And sometimes it's an overpriced strawberry mask with like the and most non-practical, <laughs> like one of these. I've never even put it on because this is so complex. <laughs> I mean, this could also be a... A bikini, he said. <laughs> it's right down there. He said, just boop, and wrap this around. <laughs> but like a little tube top now. Tube top? <laughs> oh my God, why do you look like that? Why do you look... I don't know what to do with it. <sighs> I don't feel like blowing out the candle, but I feel like coming all out here. Right. My eyelashes went <laughs> Your eyelashes go what? <laughs> Through from me blowing out the air and it went up, which is not good. Okay. This is not the most practical one. So for the price of this, you could get four of the neutral colors or four of the bobble bars or even like two of these. You could get like two packs of these, which come with six. But those you can turn it into bikinis. Exactly. So <laughs> this, this is more financially responsible because yeah. after the pandemic, I go, wait, Corona's over? Okay, <laughs> and then I go to the beach. <laughs> Can we make these jokes? This one, um, I don't know if I'll ever wear it. I'm gonna just leave it like that. Like, I'm gonna wear then it. Then why did you buy it? I'm gonna wear it. But I don't think this is gonna be my Trader Joe's mask. Like, this is gonna be like one of those like, where else do I go? Like an Instagram picture mask or like a, you know, six feet apart from my friend that I don't have. <laughs> this is not a grab and go to the grocery store type of mask. It's not gonna work for you, okay? Uh, these are not the ones I bought, okay? These are the ones that my mom got. Yeah. And she says everyone in Korea is wearing this brand called Fake Supreme. <laughs> oh, oof. Oh, I like it. <laughs> what I <wanted> to say. <laughs> I like this one more. You like that one more I than really the like off? This might be my favorite. Really? Because it's heavy duty, but it's very comfortable, breathable. Mm. And I don't know, it's just I just like it. Do I look cool? <laughs> He's got the mask on and he goes, Do I look cool? And I'm staring at him, so he goes. <laughs> you look cool. What the brand is mask. This? this is um Supreme. <laughs> Supreme, I think it's a Supreme Supreme with a seahorse on it, which I know is not the Supreme logo. Where did your mom get it? Um, from a friend. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna ask my I mom really like to it. ask her friend where they got these, and I'm gonna try to link them below. But um, <laughs> <laughs> but I will also include these. I think these are so fun. That's just embarrassment. It's not. If you think it's embarrassing, then it's gonna be hard for you because we will go out together, and I will wear this. Table for two? Table for one. I'm actually gonna show you guys how I'm gonna wash these because I've never washed these yet before. Who needs to know how you wash this? It's a huge thing, that's why you get mask knee. So the disposable ones are really dirty apparently, unless you get like the crazy like hospital ones. They're not the cleanest so they make it break out. But then these, if you wear them multiple times with all of that makeup and all the germs that like accumulate in there, they get real nasty. And so then you have to keep washing them, but then you also don't want them to shrink and you don't want them to get all weird because then you gotta buy a new mask and then suddenly it's just like a fucking, like a lip cover and your nose is fucking out. You know those people? So I'm going to Target today and I'm like, <laughs> no! Hey, you forgot your nose! Put the nose in! Wash it all weird, that's how it gets. So I saw on TikTok, everyone's washing it with castor soap, and we have it. So I'm gonna wash it, and then you hang them to dry. So I'm gonna show you how to wash them. You need a bowl, okay? You're gonna need to just fill it up with some warmish water. Okay, so I'm gonna start with three at a time, just cause I don't want any like coloring to get weird. Maybe add some cold water. And I'm gonna use this Dr. Bronner's Castile Soap, Castile Soap, I wanna say. <laughs> I think this is how they do it, and then just kind of plop these in there. If you guys have a better way to wash masks, please let me know. I heard laundry detergent might make you break out, so that's why I'm using this one instead of a laundry detergent. Okay, that one held its shape up. <laughs> it's 
like a boob. And then squeeze the water out. I don't want to break its shape though, so I'm going to hang these up really well. So I also got this hanger and I just hung them up like this because they're two each, but I've got a lot of mass, so I put these hair clips onto the little metal wire part and I'm going to hang these, put them in the sun a little bit. This is cute. I think by the time you finish with all of these masks washing and drying, the pandemic will Okay, you know what, sir? Does that not look so cool? That's totally 2020 vibes. Look at it. Honey, I have a request. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you can see. <laughs> Don't look inside this cup no matter what, okay? Actually, do you want to know what's inside the cup? Come here. Okay, show me. We're playing a game today called Spin the Is Egg. Is cook or no Whoever cook? <gasps> This is a cup, this is an egg. This is the best you'll ever have. <laughs> so you put the egg here, and then we take turns going like oh, this, lifting it, and you have part. to hit it. Like, you've seen this on seen TikTok. This. Let's it's a do bad it. idea. It's a great idea. No. <laughs> he said. <laughs> You're not doing this right. What are you doing? <laughs> what the hell are you doing? <laughs> it's an egg bed. You have to be so aggressive. But you that's how you smack okay, the egg, okay. no? How about we do this? We uh -huh. maintain eye contact with each other and we don't look at the egg. Are we just too good? <laughs> are we, just like... we just maintain eye contact with each other. I feel like we're doing something wrong, huh? <laughs> okay, oh wow, yeah. Perfect. Oh snap. Alright. Ready? Round two. Okay. Hit it. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. How do you stop doing that? I'm stop gonna, doing that. I don't know what to do. Faster. We're too slow. As fast as you can. Stephanie's a little slow. <laughs> <laughs> this is nasty. Okay, how about we close our eyes? <laughs> close our eyes. Okay, let's go. Wait, 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 look up. Uh huh. Oh, <laughs> shit. Like, what did you think was gonna happen? My hands. We've got a little, like, I'm gonna try to keep the rest. Let it slip back in there. Is no. that gross? We are here for the finale. He says I need to be more like Nicki Minaj and just hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. So I'm gonna try to do that. <laughs> Honey! Keep going, keep going, keep going. Um, um honey, why you keep doing that? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. Um, are we just too good at this? No, I think you're too slow. I'm trying so hard to be fast. I know, it's not your fault though. Why am I slow? Okay, hit it as fast as you can. Here you go. I'm so, okay, hold on. <laughs> what the heck? Show me your technique. Technique? Like, like is it a limp wrist? <laughs> yeah, limp wrist. Come on. How did you hit it so fast? I can't do it. It's okay. Um, let me give you guys a mask update. <laughs> I just act like none of that happened so I can adult again. So these masks have been out for how many hours has it been, honey? Like maybe five hours, six hours? And these ones from the neutral ones, the J Simkai, I think they're called, they're almost already dry. The ones from Evolve. The other ones are taking some time. I mean, I don't think that has anything to do with the quality of the mask, but if you guys are looking for some fast drying ones, like if you're like, listen, bits, I'm only trying to buy one and I'm gonna wash it every single night, okay? Maybe it would matter. Like these seem a little bit thick and it's gonna take some time. The supreme. the supreme is a little moist. You know, this one 
from yesterday is like winter it's just so cold and so wet and i just don't know how to feel so is this one this pleated one and then this one's pretty this one's pretty dry like this is genuinely so 2020 just like hello right next to my stove i've got my masks cleaning don't know how sanitary that is i've actually also seen some people who just boil water and then they will throw these into a pot of boiling water to disinfect it so i guess these all work i just wanted to use the castile soap because i feel like it gets rid of breakouts so that's why use that one but I heard boiling water and a little bit of like some other soap just make sure it's not laundry detergent I see a lot of people like washing their stuff with laundry detergent and laundry detergent can break your face out even if you've got like a hypoallergenic like super clean like non scented one don't do it use something that you would use on your face to clean your masks but don't use face wash because that'd be so expensive so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video let me know in the comments who you think is the best egg hitter hit it hit it hit it hit it and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Ah!